Namaste. Alright, so I want to talk about density, the density levels, um, how that relates to the ascension and the current phase we're in right now, which is actually, well, in 86, we had the, 86 or 87, uh, we had the harmonic convergence. What we're going through now, after 2017, we entered the phase of harmonic deconvergence between the third density Earth and the new Earth. So the two Earths are decoupling. Now, I've said this before. I tried to explain it before, but I didn't have any of the numbers in front of me, so I didn't do a very good job. Uh, but I tried to explain that COVID is the first wave of departures and that these will increase dramatically. And you can see why once you actually see the numbers on things. So 100 years ago, the average human was 3.5. That was the whole collective as a whole was 3.5. Right now, the current human collective is 3.8. These are approximate numbers, okay? Right now, the current human collective is 3.8 in density. The average third density human has gone up from 3.5 to 3.65. So even they are more, you know, they're higher vibration than they were. Um, but the collective is at 3.8 because of the, the awaken, which is still, you know, a small, you know, in the millions of people compared to billions but because of it is cohesive and integrative when you awaken to the light because you know so the light is integrative and it's a much more powerful force so okay so the awakened right now are falling in the range of 3.6 to 4.25 now i want you to understand i'm talking about right now physical your physical vibration, okay? Your consciousness is unbound. Your consciousness can go, but generally if you have a, a low density body, meaning you're still stuck in a lot of physical addictions or lower density drives, and your body's polluted with those types of things and, and, and all the stuff in the emotional body and astral implants, you're not going to be hitting seventh, eighth density consciousness. Okay, they may feel like that even if when you first wake up, but you may only be hitting fourth density consciousness. It just feels like that to you because of where you came from. So, but still, con your consciousness generally rises faster, always, than the body. So, if, if your body is vibrating at fourth density, generally your consciousness will be moving between like 4.5 to 6 you know, on a, when you're really in meditation or something. Now, this only applies to awakened people because uh, third density, you know, general third density people are not going to fluctuate that much in their consciousness because of specifically, you know, the structure of their experience and their mind is keeping them there. Okay. So Gaia right now has raised to 4.35. Okay. So again, the awakened are falling right now. If you've just woken up, you're going to find yourself somewhere, you know, between 3.6 and 3.75 physically. And then at the high end of the scale, we have around 4.25. Now that's, that's in the general awakening track. There are two tracks of ascenders. Okay. There's the 4D track and the 5D track. The 4D track is by far the more common track. The only people that are on the 5D track are those who woke up four or five years before the others generally, those who have been kind of leading the charge, those who are just a little bit more advanced, you know, they, they were working on helping the 4Ds, they were working on helping everything get to the point where the 4Ders could wake up. Sorry, this camera seems to be, it's because I've Stabilize. Probably annoy. Right. Um, okay. So here's the thing: you, you to be comfortable, all right. You want to be really within like 0.25 of Gaia, okay. But they within 0.5 is the range either way um, that they consider habitable 
that you can survive in that environment. So right now, like I said, Gaia has moved up to 4.35. So that means to survive on Gaia the way she is right now, you have to have a vibration of 3.85. So um, most of the awakened are already there or are moving right in there. The third densities are, have just been pushed out. Now, don't get me wrong. It's not like a line. You hit, you hit uh, 3.85 and you, and you die. No, it, that's when symptoms start to show up. That's when you start to become disharmonious with Gaia. That's when it starts to become a problem. Okay. So, so some, let's say if the collective, if the average third density collective is at 3.65, that means that the low end of the collective, those who are really into domination or control or, or anger or hatred or fear, you know, are really into all this uh, denial of truth, um, then they're going to maybe down 3.3, 3.25, 3 3.1, you know, it could be near animal consciousness. There are many humans that we look at, and they're basically functioning off animal drives with far more corruption than an actual animal would have. So that, that's why many people will say, oh, I like dogs, cats, animals much better than people, you know. So those people, 3.25, 3.3, they're way out of range now. See, they're, they're, a, they're a whole... They're a whole point at a range now. That starts to become fatal. And that's why we are seeing departures. Now, here's the thing. The ascenders, we're already in the good range. And I will talk about the other track, the 5D. So the 5D track now, you would be on right now, physically, you would be t vibrating between um, 4.0 and 4.65 right now. For above 4.65, um, where Guy is currently, if you get to 4.75, 4.85, we can get there, but um, it starts to become too much. We start to become disconnected to what's happening. We start to be like feel like we're up in the spirit realm all the time, uh, and at some point, like it's it, it literally will be like hard for you to stay grounded here. Um, so my higher self, literally, as I hit to like 4.8, my higher self pushes me back down uh, because I'm just outpacing where I'm supposed to be a little bit uh, for the collective. So, yeah, I hope that all makes sense. Um, let me think that I cover it here. Uh, yeah, so now Gaia is moving in, will eventually be a fifth density planet, okay? So... And by 2100, she, she will be a fifth density planet. Okay? So, so right now, if you're on the awaken track between 3.6 and 4.25, you're, you're, you're going to be fine moving, moving up with her. Um, and even if you're at the low end of 3.6, but that won't stay that long. You know, you'll, you'll quickly be moving up in 3.75, 3.85. Um, those on the 5D track, same thing. They're dealing with the changes fine. But the third density people at 3.65, 3.6, 3.55, they're not going any higher. See? So in another year, in another two years, when, when, when Gaia is at 4.5, 4.65, they won't be able to be here anymore. And, and they can try to launch any kind of war they want. They can try to use any guns they want. They're not going to be able to stand up. See that when you see apocalyptic movies and, and the bad guys always taking over everybody with guns and stuff, that's not how it's going down. They're not going to have the energy to shoot a gun. Love and light.